Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in Revit architecture. I am architect Sonorai from Glad Studio and in this today video tutorial, I am going to teach you about another use of thin line in Revit. So suppose uh, this is my sectional view and I am going to draw a shape here. So for this, I am going to my architecture tab here and I am going to my component and I am going to model in place and then if a model in place i am going to select generic models here and i will select generic models from this and i am going to click ok and i am going to rename this as a shapes i am going to draw a simple shapes but i am going to my extrusion here and i am going to pick a plane so i will uh, pick this uh, then here and I'm going to draw a shape here and I'm going to draw a line here and now I'm zooming it you can see this is very thick and suppose I want to draw some uh, very narrow dimensions here suppose I want half inches from here and now I'm going to draw this and you can see this is a very thick line and it is very difficult me to find this end here and suppose it is a uh, much lesser than half an inches then it is more difficult so here we can use thin line so i am going to click this thin line here tl shortcut command and now you can see this is very very clear using thin line and you can draw smaller dimensions using thin line suppose you are i want to give this as a 0. Uh, suppose i am going to enter 0. 0.05 inches enter and you can see it's very very clear using thin line but once you will turn this off you can see we are not able to see this uh, dimension clearly and you will find it very difficult so this is very handy thin lines so this was the tutorial for today's session in the next session i will come with some more interesting topics in revit thanks for watching bye bye